With our project Wireless High Power Transmission, designed in cooperation with Wurt Electronic, it is possible to send a large amount of power from one coil to another over a distance of several centimeters. Two identical converters and PCBs are used for transmitter and receiver. The main converter is designed for 50 watts and needs a power supply voltage of 12 to 24 volts. The converter of the receiver PCB works as a synchronous rectifier. Both converters are fast gate driving. The gate drive circuits have a separate power supply of 9.6 volts. This lower power supply voltage is taken from the input-output voltage by using a compact buck converter. On the transmitter PCB we added a PTC resettable fuse and an adjustable electronic fuse for the transmitter to protect the switching FETs against two large currents. On the receiver PCB these parts can be left unmounted. For safety reasons we recommend to limit the power supply voltage to 20 volts maximum and the output power to 40 watts. A notebook adapter with an output voltage of 19.5 volts and at least 70 watts power rating is an excellent choice as a power supply. The base for the circuit is a zero voltage switching converter which is known for its high efficiency. More than 90% is possible. Two identical coils placed on a small distance from each other transfer energy from one coil to the other by means of an alternating magnetic field. The output voltage on the receiver PCB is almost the same as the input voltage. The efficiency remains stable within a distance of 4 to 10 mm between the two coils. A maximum distance of up to 18 mm is possible depending on the application. The transmitter and receiver coil and the high quality capacitors on the PCBs from parallel resonance circuits both tunes to the exact same frequency. The resonance circuit directly determines the oscillator frequency. The frequency band for inductive power transfer is 100 to 205 kHz, where 105 to 130 kHz give the best results. Above 150 kHz losses in the parallel capacitors become too high. Our circuit operates at a frequency of approximately 100 kHz. There is no communication between transmitter and receiver, like specified in the Qi standard developed by the Wireless Power Consortium. So don't try to charge your phone with this circuit. To demonstrate the wireless power transmission, we connected two light bulbs of 12 volt and 10 watts in series to the receiver output. The input voltage is 19.5 volts, the standard output voltage of a regular notebook adapter. The light bulbs are well suited to show the amount of energy received while varying the distance between the two coils. At a distance of 3 to 3.5 cm, the light bulb begins to dim. At a distance of 6.5 mm, the thickness of the piece of wood between the coils, the efficiency is 88%. That's it and don't forget to link, like or subscribe to our channel. Bye bye.